Hello guys, in this video, I'm just going to explain how to set 4K resolution for your PS4 Pro in OBS Studio. You might be using Ava Media or Elgato Gaming Capture or any other gaming capture. For example, I'm using Elgato Gaming Capture Live Gamer 4K. So here is the clarity, this is 1080 pixel. But if you want to record the gameplay or do the live streaming in OBS Studio, that also you can do it. So in OBS Studio, right, by default, 1080 pixel will be displayed, okay, on the screen. So what you need to do is you need to configure as a 4K resolution if you're using PS4 Pro. So that's what I'm going to explain. Uh, before that, right, if you have opened Elgato software or uh, AV Media software, just close it. So I'm going to close this AV Media. And this is an OBS Studio. You can see this blurriness and there is less clarity, okay, in the resolutions. So I'm going to delete it. I'm going to add the fresh one, clicking on this plus button and video capture device. Here we can set the name for key and giving OK. And need to choose the capture card and give OK. And right click, transform, stretch to screen. OK, because I'm using 4K monitor. So I have just stretched it. And now I'm going to configure the video. So you can double click or right click, go to properties. You can see the clarity in the words or in the pictures after I'm making the configurations. So I'm going to make the configurations. So here we need to choose resolution type, okay? Resolution and FPS. So by default, it's a device default. I'm going to change it to custom. And here I need to choose this resolution. If you want to record in 2K format, that also you can do or 1080 pixel and 60 FPS also you can do it, okay? You can choose your configurations, which is displaying in the resolution. And I'm going to choose 4K, super cool. Now you can see some better clarity, even in the wordings. You can see some better clarity now, okay? Then FPS should be uh, 60 FPS because my capture card supports up to 60 FPS and then video format should be uh, MV12. You can just play around with this XRGB, YU, Y2, but NV12 is good and go to color space and here I'm going to choose 709 and uh, the color range should be full. That's it. Now perfect clarity is set for our PS4 Pro in OBS Studio. So you can choose the audio output mode, but this is the configurations. We need to set it. Okay. And also you can increase the brightness or uh, contrast. Even we can make the sharpness. So go to configure video. So under configure video, right? Go to video proc amp and here you can increase this brightness. By default, it's a 131. So you can increase it. Okay. And contrast also you can adjust and make the sharpness. Once it's set right, give up play and okay, then okay. That's it. 4K resolution is set perfectly. And also check your uh, overall OBS Studio settings. So for that, right, we need to go to settings. Here also we can set the 4K settings for streaming and recording and go to output tab. If you're going to stream, just set this setup and just copy this and for recording, right? And the recording format should be MP4, encoder should be our graphics card and the ray scale output should be disabled. The rate control should be CVR, bitrate should be 45,000. I mean, you can set 40,000 to 45,000. And the preset as quality and profile as main. Once it's set right, click on Apply. And next, go to Video. And here we need to choose 4K resolutions as a base canvas resolution and output as 4K. Next, downscale filter as lag source and the common FPS values is 60. So we need to set according to this. And next, go to advanced and here we need to choose above normal or high. I will choose above normal and the color format should be NV12. Color space should be 709 and color range should be full. Once all set right, just click on apply and give OK. Super cool. Now you can record your PS4 Pro gameplay in 4K format in OBS Studio. Even you can live stream as a 4K format. Now you can see the better quality here. Don't forget, you need to close Elgato software or uh, AV Media software if you're using. So that's it, friends. Hope this video is very much helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please put your comments and feedbacks in my video forms. Thank you. Bye and take care.